guys, before the video starts, make sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification, select all, and become a member if you would like. Also, leave a like on the video. And now let's get into the video. How's it going, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Like Me and Easy. And today, guys, I'm going to be showing you how you can connect your Xbox One to a monitor um, without using HDMI. Well, using an HDMI cable just with a monitor that does not have an HDMI port. Um, so my monitor is actually a great example of this right here. Um, as my monitor only contains, I believe it's DVI and VGA on the back. Yeah, I believe so. So it's kind of hard to see there, but that's the DVI port and then it's plugged into the um, DVI port. And v I, so I have DVI and VGA and there's the power supply right there. So guys, I was I was searching through YouTube just to like find a tutorial um, on how to do this. And the last one that was made was like three years ago. So I was like, okay, may as well, me of all people should make one of these since this is actually a major problem that people are experiencing, right? Um, so I'm going to show you how to do it. It's very simple and easy. All you need is a little adapter that costs probably less than five bucks on eBay. Um, they also sell these on Amazon. It's going to be either a HDMI female to a DVI male, or it's going to be an HDMI female to VGA uh, male converter. Um, and I'm gonna show you what that looks like. So, as you can see here, this is the back of an Xbox One, correct? Every Xbox One comes with a cable HDMI port back here, and it says HDMI out. Uh, it's a little tough to see just because it's dark here, but so this is standard, just standard HDMI. Now this takes your audio and your video out of your console, right? Um, that's what HDMI cables do. So this cable, the one that comes with the Xbox, if we come up here and I come back here, this is going to be connected to the back of the monitor. So I'm currently using a HDMI female, as you can see here, to a DVI male plugging into the DVI port in the back of my monitor. Um, I'm not using the VGA as this is not a VGA adapter. This is a DVI adapter. It's very easy to install. It installs right into the DVI port right here. Uh, you just tighten those screws. And as you can see, if I can do this with one hand, this is the Xbox HDMI cable right here. Let me just get this out here. So this is the cable that I showed earlier um, coming out of the console. And you just take this port, plug it in to the back of the converter um, and then you should just power up your console and it should display as normal now just bear in mind DVI does not transmit since we're using a DVI converter in the back of the monitor it's not going to transmit the audio so you're going to have to get external speakers or um, something easier you just come down here guys get get, a, get the adapter for the controller and just plug in headphones it, this is the best solution I have don't go out and try to buy external speakers. Just buy the stupid uh, converter right here, and uh, you should be good to go. You can use any existing headphones you want, um, and it works great. So, guys, that's going to be it for this tutorial. If you all enjoyed, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and uh, hit that notification bell so you guys know exactly when I upload in the future. Um, check out Life Music Podcast if you guys are interested in podcasts. Um, we're uploading a new episode tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. You also subscribe to Gaming Made Easy, which... Um, I've been live streaming some Battlefront 2, if you're into that. Um, links in the description. Uh, if you guys want to support me, donations are always welcome. And I, you can also pick up some of my merch down in the description. I'm trying to work on getting a new PC uh, for the channel. So guys, that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.